And hey, this is Francisco from Dr. Phone, and welcome to this channel. In this video, I will be going over how to downgrade your iOS device from iOS 14 beta to iOS 13. While iOS 14 does have a lot of nice new features, it's also still pretty buggy because it's still in beta, and not everybody is willing to deal with these issues until the full release. So if you're tired of it, and if you want to downgrade all the way back to iOS 13, there is a simple way of doing so that doesn't require any technical skills at all. So let's go ahead and dive right in. And before we get into this video, just go ahead and make sure to subscribe to this channel and then go ahead and turn on that notification bell so that you don't miss any of our intuitive tutorials. Also, let us know what your thoughts are about this video in the comments below and let us know of any other tutorials that you have in mind that you would like us to cover in the future. Before we go ahead and downgrade, I think it's going to be very important here that we go ahead and back up all of our files first so that you can recover them after you roll back to iOS 13. So first, go ahead and launch your doctor phone. And if you haven't downloaded it already, then we will be leaving links in the description for you to be able to download this essential piece of software as we will be using this to both back up our device and actually revert it back to iOS 13. So make sure that you do have it, it is very important. And then after you finally gone ahead and downloaded it and installed Dr. Phone, and then just go ahead and plug in your iPhone onto your computer. Then go ahead and handpick your files that you want to back up and click on start and just give it a moment and your data is already backed up and ready to go. And now we're going to get into downgrading to iOS 13 using Dr. Phone as well. So here are going to be all of those steps encompassed into a very simple tutorial. On the Dr. Phone dashboard, click on System Repair. And now connect your iPhone to your computer using a high quality USB cable. This is going to be important. And when Dr. Phone detects your iPhone, go ahead and click on Standard Mode. And this is going to be a pretty good solution just to go ahead and fix your iPhone as well, which is a fun note. And if your iPhone is not going to function properly, and then just go ahead and follow the instructions that you're going to be seeing on the screen, and that is going to take you into DFE mode, which is going to be essentially some sorts of recovery mode for iOS devices. Now you need to go ahead and select the proper device model and firmware information in Dr. Phone to get the perfect results in this process. As you are downgrading from iOS 14 beta to iOS 13, you need to select the old iOS firmware, and then once you're ready, go ahead and click on start. After waiting just a little while for this download to finish, you're just going to verify that this firmware package is actually going to be the correct one. And once it's all ready, go ahead and click on fix now. And then this is going to repair your iOS device and get it back to its previous version. And then once that's done, your iPhone is just going to restart normally and now your iPhone has iOS 13 instead of iOS 14 beta. And great, so we managed to revert back to the great iOS 13. And if you have any questions, then make sure to let us know in the comments below and we will make sure to get right back to you. Also, like always, don't forget to subscribe for more great content just like this and I will be seeing you next time. So, bye-bye.